Barstow, California is next. Go ahead. Yes, I want to make one point, and that is main point. Alexander the Great was not a Greek. He was Macedonian. <laughs> Macedonians are Slavic race. And there was a fight between Philip, his father, and Greeks. Because Greeks want to expand north, he kept them at bay. And the other point that I, when I study Western history, they keep saying that Greece is Westerners. Greeks did not come from West, they came from East. And that's my point. Very good. You've touched on a couple of the most uh, interesting conversations that are, in sometimes heated debates, that are taking place among scholars of uh, Bronze Age and early Greece today. Um, I think that you, at the moment, the consensus among most scholars of ancient Macedonia is that the language, the linguistic affiliation of the Macedonians is Greek. It is certainly true they spoke their own dialect of, of Greek and that people in mainland Greece sometimes, in fact, had trouble understanding what Macedonians were saying and vice versa. Uh, there certainly was a good deal of uh, marriage between mainland Greece families into the uh, nobility among the Macedonians. And there certainly is no doubt that by the time Philip comes to uh, the throne in the 350s, that he is presenting himself both to the Macedonians and to the Greeks as a Greek. What he is claiming is Macedonian preeminence, that is, the right to rule over the rest of the Greek world.